After the recent terror attacks in San Bernardino as well as Paris, Tucson police received so many requests for active shooter training, the department held its first public class. More than 75 people attended the class designed to teach someone how to react in an active shooter situation. Now your side's Ricky Mitchell has more on the training. Margot Susco owns a clothing store in a busy part of downtown and says safety is a priority in her business. Especially these days in this climate, you never really know what's going to be happening, so I just want to be prepared. Susco is one of dozens of people who wanted to learn from Tucson police how to react in an active shooter situation. And the interest has been extremely large. Officer Christopher Goins with Tucson police says the class teaches the run, hide, fight method of response, meaning if you have an opportunity to escape, leave your belongings behind and evacuate the building. If not, find a quiet place to hide, block the door and turn off the lights. And in a last attempt to survive, improvise weapons and try to stop the shooter. We're going to show you how we respond in these situations. Tucson police says the probability that you will ever be in this kind of situation is very low, but officers still recommend developing an emergency plan. Things are changing in this world and it's just smart to be aware of your surroundings, to be aware of where you are, to do your best to prepare yourself for any situation. Um, and to keep your eyes open. And the instructor tonight also talked about possible red flags that could indicate possible violent behavior in someone. We've added all of those red flags to this story on KGun9.com. Now, Tucson Police does plan to offer additional training classes like the one tonight. You can find information on that on the Tucson Police Facebook page.